Well, hello there. How's it going? So, um, I've heard you guys loud and clear, and I understand you guys' frustration. Uh, so, if you guys don't understand what's going on, I made two videos before this where I talked about NVIDIA's GeForce experience and issues with it and how to fix those issues when it comes to game uh, audio not working with... Uh, your video visuals or with your mic or your mic and all that stuff and people have been having issues where like uh nvidia would be changing their uh what's it called the audio settings and all that stuff like right over here uh it would be playing around with their settings by itself or it would be not recording your, your microphone or not recording your uh game audio or anything and it's there's so there's like constant issues even after you fix them they would just reappear again out of nowhere like if nvidia just reset them for some reason and there was no like i, I kept i after those two videos i realized that it worked for 50 percent of the people and the other 50 percent would just spam hate comments in my comment section below which was annoying um but because it's not my fault at all but uh Whatever, uh, I'm here to show you guys a more permanent fix, and I'm not sure how permanent this fix is, is because I w did my own personal research, and I I'm just as annoyed uh, from it as you guys, and I've realized that the best way to uh, fix this issue is to attack it at the source. NVIDIA uses... Uh, their hardware to record gameplay with almost no effect whatsoever at your performance your gaming performance so how can you do that almost but without nvidia so without nvidia software so you're using nvidia's hardware but without nvidia software which is terrible well it's very simple actually if you go to OBS. So if you guys don't know what OBS is, you can I'll let it put a link down in the description. You can download it. It's a free uh, streaming software or recording software, and you can actually set it up uh, by doing exactly what you do now and go ser uh, search how to set it up on YouTube specifically for recording. But I'm going to be talking about a specific setting that actually makes your uh, OBS use your GPU instead of your CPU when it comes to encoding uh, a video. So as you can see right now, I have, like if you see down here, I'll zoom in in it. I have only 1.3% or 2% of CPU being used right now. And I'm recording this video at 60 FPS. But if you notice, I literally have the world's worst CPU. <laughs> it's a fourth gen CPU from the stone age and it's great like normally my cpu could not even run obs while recording vid games or anything it would just be unplayable unbearable and it would have uh, cut frames but using this setting it actually works perfectly fine just as if i was using shadow play uh so it's very simple you just go to the settings i'm sorry for rambling on i put a time stop in the start if you wanted to skip but if uh, this is just to show how it actually works, if you go to settings, then you go over here to output. Of course, these settings, you guys can set it up in uh, a different video. Uh, I'm not going to be explaining that. But if you go to output, you can make the video bit rates, whatever you please. Of course, the higher, the better. And this rendering quality, you can make it... Uh, I did not notice that big of a performance difference when it comes to making this higher using this method because it would use your hardware, not your software. So this is like changing the settings in NVIDIA Shadowplay as well. Uh, so what you want is I, I use this, but the problem is with if you use this for large recordings uh, or long recordings, it takes a lot of memory, like for five minutes or 10 minutes of gameplay. It, got it it was an eight gigabyte video so indistinguishable is probably a little bit too high but it literally looks like how it looks like in game almost recording format make it an mp4 or whatever you wish uh and encoder this is the most important thing in 
encoder, choose this one, hardware, then NVIDIA's uh, uh, API or plugin or whatever you want to call it. This right here is what Shadowplay uses to uh, record uh, video without affecting your CPU or your computer performance. There's one issue to this is that it, uh, OBS will affect your FPS by around, I'd say, an average of 5%. If that is an issue to you, uh, I don't think this fix is going to be um, for you, but 5% 5 5 is not that big of a difference. And honestly, if you are playing light games like CSGO or uh, Fortnite or uh, whatever games you guys play, like Rainbow Six Siege and all these games, they're, most, they're very light games, like they already run at high frame rates. And most people that have modern CPUs and all that, they won't have this issue. But for you that do, this will affect a little bit. And if you're noticing lag while you're recording, I would recommend while you're recording to minimize uh, OBS because the preview actually affects your performance. Uh, you can just disable preview like that, yeah. Okay, so pretty much what you can do is uh, like this, disable preview and put it to your second monitor and you can monitor if your audio is being recorded, if your desktop audio is being recorded and all that to make sure that everything is working fine and not, you know, doing the same stuff that uh, NVIDIA is doing. I've noticed that this method significantly helps the set, uh, settings wise to you not having issues when it comes to recording and um, I'm sorry for rambling on in this video, but I'm just saying, I'm just trying to explain how this works uh, because some people have issues with this. Is If you set it up right, where you have desktop audio and the mic audio separated, you can actually, in the settings itself, you can make it so that there's two tracks of audio that record separately, and you can you mute the desktop audio but keep the mic audio and all that. It's very nice. It's just like NVIDIA software, and uh, it works fine. It works perfectly. Um, yeah. So that's pretty much it for this video. If you do have any issues with this or you need help in anything, leave a comment down below. But please check if the solution is already in the in the comments or not, because some people ask uh, repeated questions. And if you don't like this fix, you can check out my other two fixes, but I do not recommend them. <laughs> they do work for some people. Uh, I'd say about 70% or 60%, but for others it doesn't, so uh, yeah, it's tested out of your own luck. Hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you for watching. Peace.